Hello everyone, thank you for taking the time to join me. Today I'm going to be going over our Berna HD slash SD outside the waistband holster. Our Berna HD outside the waistband holster is also compatible with the Berna SD. The Berna SD and the Berna HD are essentially the same size. There are a few differences, but none of the differences affect the holster and the holster fitment. So whether you have a Berna HD or a Berna SD, this holster will fit your launcher. We have a bunch of different options to choose from when selecting your holster. The first thing you want to choose is whether you're left-handed or right-handed. Obviously, that's pretty self-explanatory. If you're left-handed, you get a left-handed one. If you're right-handed, you get a right-handed one. We also have options for the color, the inside color and the outside color. We also have attachment options, whether you have a mounted flashlight, whether that be a Surefire, Olight, or a Crimson Trace. And we also have an option for the Merciless Lethal 12 gram adapter. We also have options for different belt clips. We have four different options for belt clips. I will explain a little bit more about those in just a minute. For the Merciless Lethal option we have here, we have the Merciless Lethal, which protrudes past the end of the muzzle. And on our holsters, we make the Merciless Lethal attachment open in case you want to add a fast cap later on down the road. That's not going to interfere with the holster. The key components to our Berna outside the waistband holster, or any holster really, is that it covers the trigger and the trigger guard area. It doesn't necessarily have to cover all of the trigger guard area, but it has to cover all the trigger so that you cannot stick a finger in there and pull the trigger, or a pen can't get in there, or a thread can't get in there. The idea is that nothing can get inside and pull it while it's in your holster. Another feature that we have on this one is we have a full sweat guard, which completely covers the safety. That prevents the safety from being activated or deactivated from your clothes or just touching it or whatever might be activated. Now, obviously you can still manipulate the safety on the other side, but when it's rubbing up against your body, this is gonna protect the safety. Our holsters have adjustable retention. There's a screw on the bottom that you can tighten or loosen to adjust the retention. You can either make it tighter or looser. You can also remove it altogether if you want to have the least amount of retention. We also have adjustable carry angle. Adjustable carry angle can be achieved by removing the two screws on the belt loops and moving them up a notch or down a notch. That will adjust the angle and ride height of the holster on your belt. We have several different belt options for the Berna HD slash SD holster. We have the standard bent wings. This is our standard option. This is the recommended option that we have. This will hold the holster as close to your body as possible. We have these available in 1.5 and 1.75 inch belt loops. Our other option is our what we call our universal loops. The universal loops will accept a belt two inches all the way down to 1.5 inches. The reason you would select this option is if you have a big Cobra belt buckle or if you have a duty belt. That will be the reason you'd select this option. The disadvantage of this option is that due to the way the belt loops are shaped and the way they mount, they are the holster is going to be farther away from the body than if you had the bent wings. So if concealment is your goal, you would need to go with the bent wings. Again, if you have a big belt buckle that won't fit through your regular belt loops, this is gonna be a good option. Now our fourth belt attachment option is the UltiClip XL. Now the UltiClip XL can be used as a belt loop. You can fish your belt through here and you can use this as a 1.5 inch belt loop. Again, this isn't going to be as tight to the body as the bent wings, but this will hold it closer to the body than the universal belt loops. The advantage to the UltiClip is you will be able to attach it quickly onto your belt without having to remove your belt. Let's say you don't want to unfish your belt through all your belt loops. You can just use this and clip it on and it's going to be a pretty, pretty fast option compared to fishing it through all your belt loops. The other advantage to the UltiClip XL is you can wear this holster if you are not wearing a belt. We absolutely do not recommend it. You can do that with the UltiClip XL. The UltiClip XL, the right height and carry angle can be adjusted the same way. Just remove the screws and raise and lower each side to get your desired carry angle and ride height. Now the UltiClip XLs do tend to bend if you are not very careful. That is not covered under the warranty. There are a bunch of videos on YouTube on how you can rebend your UltiClip XL to get it back the way it needs to be. Now, if you purchase the UltiClip XL option from us, we will include two bent wings. That way, if these do bend, you can throw on the bent wings and you can still have your holster and still use it. As far as color options, you can pick the inside color and the outside color. 
The available colors are usually depending on what we have in stock and what we can get, what we can get from our suppliers, as there are sometimes can be fluctuations in what's available, what's not available. We have a bunch of flashlight options, whether that be from Crimson Trace, Surefire, or Olight, we do have a bunch of options available. Thank you guys so much for taking time to watch this video. I hope you're able to learn something from it. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to email us. Our contact information can be found on our website at www.shadowdefensive.com. Thanks again for watching, and as always, stay strapped.